Hey everyone, welcome back. Um, I'm so glad you're joining us. We have yet another unboxing. Um, I'm excited to share this one with you. Now, let's dive in. I didn't want to take up too much time because I know you're anxious to see what's in here. This is another um, Helpsy Source box. I think I have another one or two coming in. And I know y'all love checking these boxes out. I know I do. I do a lot of videos. Um, while I'm talking, I don't want to keep you too long, and I know you guys are probably like, open the box, open the box. Um, my opinion for Helpsy Source and places like New Attack, New Attack Outlet is you really kind of have to figure out your cog, and you really do have to research the company. Um, figure out what works for you and your business model. There are definitely boxes on both these sites that I will not buy because the cog is just ridiculously high. So, with that being said, the same thing with Boutique by the Box. Some of their cogs are just really high. Now you have Thread Up, where your cog is typically really, really low, but you also get a lot of junk to go with the items that can sell really well. So it's a give and take, right? Okay. Oh, cool. Okay, I ordered a jewelry box. So I'm really excited to see what we got here. Um, there are quite a few pieces in here. Now, these I do believe, the cog, I'll, I'll, I'll comment over here for y'all so you know for sure. Um, I think, I, I can't remember what all I paid for this. So I will leave in the comments, or, or leave over here what I paid for the box. So I'm not going to give you a quote because I don't remember exactly. I got some of these at a discount. Um, I had, I think it was like a 25% off or something. Um, they were doing a sale, so I got a few boxes. Um, so I think the cog on this was like two or two fifty a piece. But let me show you a few of these. There's quite a few in here, so I don't want to take up too much of y'all's time. Now the brand, let me kind of come up close so you can see this. The brand of these pieces was by Gennaro. Hopefully y'all can see that. Okay, and I just got a box of that specific brand. Um, this is, I'm trying to figure out what this is. Okay, so it's a necklace on one. Oh, I see, they just turned it around. Okay, so this one is a choker. And I'll probably list these like I do my other jewelry. All my platforms, I list my jewelry uh, for between 20 to 25 depending on the piece. If they're really nice pieces and they're like three layer necklace or something or they're a set, they go for around 30. Um, now, I really don't sell jewelry on eBay. It just doesn't sell. As we all know, jewelry on eBay is just super, super inexpensive for people to buy. So I have things listed there. But I may have sold maybe one piece of jewelry in the whole year we've been on there, over a year now. Um, but I do sell on Poshmark and Macari. I sell jewelry on Poshmark and Macari. And I do sell them well. Um, this is, looks like a double layer chain pendant. I apologize, it's kind of hard to see this. Um, so I will be listing all of these. I don't know if I'm going to take the time to list them on eBay. We'll see. But that's a couple of the pieces. Let's see what else we have. Now, I, I did kind of take a gamble on this box. Um, oh, it's kind of nice that they actually give you the size on these so I don't have to measure it. This is, these are a, a cluster of rings, size 7. I'm kind of coming up close for y'all, see, because don't worry about seeing me. Look at this here. Um, again, it's the same brand. Oh, this one is actually New York and Company, so it's not just that. It is a mix of um, brands. Okay, so this has a myriad of different rings on it, size 7. Um, so that, yeah, I'll probably put that up for about 25 maybe. 20 to 25. And on my platforms, I always take offers. And if it's a reasonable offer, depending on my cog, I accept. So, um, yeah, people are, yeah, there's different brands in here. That's really kind of cool. Um, okay, so this one is a Francesca's. And this is a necklace. It's really getting chilly over here. We have definitely dropped in temperatures. We're already getting, um, so as you can see, this is a pendant necklace. It's a silver chain. 
Um, my parents live in Billings, Montana, and our one of our daughters and their two kids and her husband live in Sealy Lake, and they've already gotten quite a few inches of snow. So we are anticipating we will probably be starting to get some snow here too. Um, we're actually kind of anxiously waiting because we would like to see some snow. It doesn't really bother us having snow here. Um, we don't mind it. This is another beautiful pendant. This is, um, this is kind of like a gemstone pendant. Really pretty. Now, another reason why I got this, because again, I wanted to have the other jewelry that I get from the company that I buy from, they are not branded. They're just general jewelry pieces, nice pieces. Like I said, I've sold a lot of them. I wanted to have some pieces, especially for the holidays, that have a brand. Because some people do ask me if my jewelry has a brand and it doesn't. And sometimes they purchase and sometimes they don't. So I wanted to give people the option of actually having a brand to pick from. And um, have a variety of jewelry available also. Now this is kind of cool. This is for those fun people who like to have the bigger ring pieces. Um, this is um, Manishi. Um, so I'll probably put this up for maybe like 15. Um, something like that. Just a simple piece. Um, again, I'm just kind of going off the cuff with my prices. I may change that. I don't know until I get into it. And run cogs but again these were like I think they were like 250 a piece so not bad at all okay these are cute hair clips I love the variety in here this is a really cute bow hair clip for somebody who wants to uh, put a clip in the back or the side of their hair and it's just a really pretty gold color I just want to hold it up for a minute so y'all can see it without me rushing to take it down off screen Another really cute piece, same thing. It's kind of like a barrette, but this one has some texturing on it. Can you see all, can you all see that okay? Hopefully. And then another one of these. Really, really cute pieces. These are great holiday gifts for like a teenager for her hair. Or for some gals who like to pull the sides up. These are great back hair pieces to just kind of clip your hair up, especially if you have um, like th um, thin to medium hair. I have really thick hair, so these don't typically work really well for me. My hair just falls out, so I can't typically wear those very well. Okay, let's see what this is. I think this is a necklace. And I am going to take all of these out to photograph, so I have no problem pulling these out for y'all. So we can see a few of these. Oh, they have these tassels. Okay, um, let's see here. I'm trying to pull this out so you all can kind of see it. It has tassels and they have these things wrapped around the tassels to protect them, which I love. Because that way it doesn't get all like crazy. You know, I think I'm just going to leave this until I pull it out to do the photographs. Let me just kind of show you. They have this plastic wrapped around, see these tassels here? This is like a gray beaded necklace with, with black tassels. Really cute and it's got some gold detail on it. And again, I don't want to really pull all that out until I do the pictures um, because I don't want the tassel covers to come off. Um, so yeah, that's really cute. So yeah, I'll definitely probably put that up for around 25. Okay, here's another one, cute. Again, nice variety in here. I like that. Let me show you this one kind of up close so y'all can kind of see the detail. And then I'm going to back it up so you can see the whole piece. So a nice choker necklace. And I do do measurements on my jewelry if they're danglies or necklaces. I do measurements so that people can see how long a piece is so that they know what the length is that they're looking for. Okay, this is, let's see what this is. This looks a little bit different. I'm trying to be careful so I don't, okay, very good. Okay, here we go. Yeah, we're good. Okay, so another looks like choker necklace. This is, let me show you the pendant. Hopefully that's not too close, I apologize. And then it's got this multiple stranded piece 
um, necklace piece to it. So again, I'll take a close-up of the pendant, and then I take um, a length for everybody, and that's got a clasp closure, so that's really kind of pretty. It's kind of a retro plus boho look, and I do put those descriptions in my um, in my listings, if I remember when I'm doing my listings. Um, I just use all different kinds of descriptions for things, and I try to put the majority of my descriptions in the actual title. Um, and then also I do do the, um, what are those, um, not thumbnails, what are those uh, pointer, pointer keywords or whatever. Okay, um, and what else do we have here? There's a lot in this box, so I'm not going to take all the time to go through this. But this will give you a general idea if you're on the site and you see this box and you're like, hmm, is this worth it? Okay, this is a very unique piece. You do not see this very many places. I'm just going to kind of put it out on my hand. This is like a snake necklace. I don't want to be kind of, I don't want to creep anybody out. Um, but this is a snake necklace and it has inset rhinestones for the detail. And it's got this beautiful gold chain to it. I'm going to back up and let you see a little bit further back. So for people who like something like that, that would be really pretty with like a, a black dress or something. If you want to just kind of have something funky, going to a party or dancing or something like that, that'd be cool. Again, these are all really great Christmas ideas for people. Or if it's somebody's birthday. Um, so all different options there, y'all. We are actually in the process. I've already got some of these other boxes listed. Um, I was working on some of the denim, but I have to be honest, this last denim box I've been working on, quite a few pieces in there I'm not going to be listing. I'm probably going to take them down to my local thrift store. And then I'm just, I am going to unbox the other denim box. And we are working on um, the boutique by the box, new with tags. And then we're also still working on that whatnot box. We're going to finish those up and uh, mix those in with the new with tags. And I have more inventory coming in because we are getting low on inventory. We have been um, doing the 20 um, listings a day. Um, all my, almost all my other jewelry is listed from the other box. And we'll be working on this. Um, I do have a lot of new tags up now, which is great for the holidays. So we're just going to keep working on that because we're going to be doing that even after the holidays now too. So here's another really unique piece, y'all. It's got, again... Um, inside rhinestones on some of the chain. I don't know if y'all could see that very well on the, on the, uh, there you go. And then it's just the gold chain up top. Really pretty piece. This could go with so many different tops or a, a dress, um, whatever. So a nice little variety for some people. So I'm excited to get these listed and see how they do. Again, my, my biggest goal is to double or triple my money. So even if I made $10, $12 um, on an item, and because again, I think my clock is like two or $2.50. Um, so, sorry, this is not going in here very well. There we go. Oh, it's because they had it turned. I'm going to learn to figure it out yet. Oh, sorry, guys. Okay, um, so yeah, if my cob was two fifty, I'm even making five or seven fifty. Um, so if I sold something even for ten or twelve dollars between the, the uh, platform fees, um, yeah, that would be good. So it doesn't always have to be. Fit. I'm just gonna leave it that way because I don't want to take up all your all's time just trying to put things back in a bag. Okay, this one is very different. I kind of have my hair down today just to keep me warm. Um, it is very, very chilly, and I actually enjoy wearing my hair down. I wear it up a lot, but I got my hair done the other day, so I've just been enjoying her straightening that she did. Okay. Oh, my goodness, you guys. Look at these. This is a set, I think, or individual pieces. Very, very pretty. Um, these are, they're beaded. Okay, I'm going to kind of come up close a little bit. Hopefully, you can see the detail there. They're flower beaded necklaces. They're like chokers. And then this one is peach. Very, very pretty. Now, when I do my photographs, the reason why I'm saying this, I'm looking at the back. I picture the front and the back. 
Um, and then sometimes, depending on the piece, I might show the closure. But I do front, back, and then I do a length on my, all my pieces just to really give a good information for the listings. Okay, we still have a few in here. I'll show you a couple more pieces. Okay, we have some more rings here. New York, New York Company. I'll show you a couple more pieces, and then we'll let that be. And how long? Okay, it's been 20 minutes already. I don't want to take up too much of time on these. Uh, these are cubic zirconia. Okay, so these are basically the same thing, um, just different sizes. This one is size size six, two cubic zirconia rings, cute. And then this one is a size seven, kind of low in the. So there's those, and I'm gonna show you maybe one more, and I'll let y'all go. Okay, now these are showing retail of $19.95, so y'all probably put those up for like 15 or 18. And let me see, I'm gonna pick something, something fun. Ooh, let's see what this is. We'll do this as our last piece. Again, this is through um, Cozy Threads, right? The, uh, yeah, Helpsy Source. I still call it Cozy, but it is Helpsy Source, I guess. Um, but this is the jewelry uh, box through Cozy. Um, again, I got 25% off, I'm pretty sure, on my boxes. This is just really kind of pretty for somebody. It um, It's almost kind of like a rose gold. Um, I don't know if y'all saw the detail of that. It's kind of like, almost like a leaf, and it's kind of like a rose gold, and then it has a clasp in the back. So re another really pretty choker. Um, with the holidays coming up, some of these would be great for like holiday parties or dinners, um, or if you, if you have a job or you have an office meetings or something you want to wear some nice jewelry pieces with your um your you know dresses and skirts for your outfits and stuff some of these pieces would be so great for something like that okay so again i'm not going to go through all of these i don't want to take up too much of your time i know i've already mentioned that um and i will note over here right now how much i paid for the maybe i'll put it over here how much i paid for the box and um what it is for the cog and then this video will probably Maybe go up next week. I've got one more video that I'm going to be doing this week. I hope you all have been enjoying these videos. Um, I will probably do a 90-day update on this box as well. If you haven't yet seen our 90-day updates, we've done a couple of them now. Um, we do all kinds of videos between, again, changes that we're doing in our business, updates. Um, you know, We do Goodwill hauls. We do unboxings. I do what's sold videos. Um, and just all different kinds of things like that. So if you haven't yet, please do subscribe so you know when we're doing these videos. You'll know when the 90 day update is being done on this. And also, um, please give this a thumbs up. If seeing what came on this box is a help to you, or you really enjoy these videos, please do give it a thumbs up. So much growth going on with our YouTube channel. I'm so excited about where it's going. I just really appreciate y'all. And um, for you returning who are um, who have been joining us and liking our videos, thank you so much. And guys, until next time, have a wonderful evening, and we'll see you in the next video.